Oh, got this in the mail today. This better be my cloak pin. It's about that size. Left the last one in Alaska, so we get to get another one. Yellow tape. Oh, that's a... Well, that's been around for a while. So we have a warning on here. Cancer and... Repro okay, well, I am uh, alarmingly still on board for this. Okay, let's get that vintage antique tape off of there. Okay. Let's see what we're dealing with here. Trying to use this hand since the other hand is shaking right now for some stupid reason. My shaky hand. My left side gets shaky sometimes. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, I'll try to hold the phone steady. All right. Nicely oiled. It's good hard steel. Now this, the gate, this is called the gate, right? Is way too big. So that sort of sucks. The pin, I like the length of the pin. Um, it doesn't need to be very long compared to the gate. I like the twists only because it, I help it, it helps catch the fabric. Um, but yeah, it's a lot of oil on that damn thing. That's good though. I'll wipe it off with a rag. So, because it's a high carbon, so this is going to rust. You just know it's going to rust. Just get over it. Accept that fact. Anyway, I like it. I can blunt that up a little bit. doesn't need to be that sharp. So, what is it? For 10 bucks? It's not bad. Like I said, I'd like this gate to be... The gate only needs to be big enough to pass the pin. That's absolutely it. If it's too big, you will lose your fabric out of it. 